Howdy from Western Utah. I'm James Hagedorn from the Denver Museum of Nature and Science, and I'm out here with several colleagues studying the layered sedimentary rocks that you see behind me here. One of the things that we're interested in is what environments do these rocks represent, and how do they tell us about how this place changed through time to get to where we are today. One of the challenges that geologists face is that mountain building processes have tilted the rocks and squished them in different orientations. And so fortunately, we use some specialized tools like this special compass called a Brunton to measure the orientation of these rocks. And then we can calculate how they were originally deposited. But what's really cool is we can also use tools like this to look at the scoop shaped structures in the rocks, the cross bedding and channels that were formed by ancient rivers and streams. And we can measure the orientation of those channels, which tells us the flow direction of those ancient rivers and streams. It also tells us what was uphill and what was downhill in deep time.